Hi, Debbie here. I was in a swap with Vilma. Her YouTube is Teacup and Roses. So this has come all the way from Chile because that's where she lives. We were doing um, pocket letters. So let me show you the pocket letter that she has made for me. So I want to open it in front of you because anybody who knows Vilma, you're going to know this is going to be amazing. Because she is. She does awesome work. She's crocheted all around this. I know I always, she crochets such really pretty things. She's done that. And we have some flowers, which I can poof up real easy because you know they're going to get flattened out in shipping, but that's no big deal. These, these fluff right back up. So that's really nice. There's that, and let's see what is in here. And I know she's already received mine. We were holding off until I received hers, so. Oh, knocking everything down. Is that okay, guys? I'm sorry. You still going? have this. She has a tied with seam binding, so I'm just going to do that. Oops, there's a knot, so let me slide it through. There we go. Oh, we have some ephemera here. There's this. This doily, is that pretty? Handmade with my oh, she made these, huh? Do I have to open it from the top? I think so. Let's see what she's done here. Oh, see if I can. Oh, she must use some really strong. Ooh. I wanted to show it to you, but I can't even open it. Let me run and get some scissors. Sorry guys, but I wasn't expecting I wasn't expecting this to be so hard to open. What has she made here? Look at this trim she's made. Oh, and it's so long. Whoa, look how much. Roses and butterflies and little pieces of different material and lace. Oh, Velma, this is awesome. I'm just going to set that right over here if I don't knock anything down. <laughs> Look at all this she's made. Can I get in this one easily enough? Yeah. Oh my goodness. 
goodness, Velma, look at all this. Look at all these things she crochets. Heart. And a flower with the bead inside. Some flowers. Oh, here's some more crochet. Her crocheting is it's gorgeous. She is so good. Flowers. Oh, and she's got some trim wrapped around this little ticket here. This is what the trim looks like. Isn't that pretty? And a button. These are cute. Oh, here's another crochet flower. Oh, I love these crochet flowers. A paper flower. Fly. Oh, here's a pin. And some sequins. Oh, these are flat back. Oh, these are little flat back. Um, they're not really pearls, but they're little crystals. They're bling things. You know. Some little flowers. These are cute. I like these little ones. Oh, some fiber. Some eyelash trim. Ooh, this is like velvet. A little flower. This is like a, it's not really a button, but it's like a, you can use the like the center of a flower. That'd be cute for that. A cloth. Here's some more of these little paper flowers. Oh, and another little teeny. Oh, look at that little lady. Oh, that's cute. And some other cute little flowers. And here's some more. There's a bow. Oh, Velma, you sent me so much doily. And this is another... I don't know if she made this or not, but that's really pretty. Oh, my. Let me just set this to the back, and then this should be the pocket letter. I think she has that wrap. Trying not to knock anything down. <laughs> Look at that. Rose, Angel, this big doily. I'm sure she crocheted this. I'm, I'm, I'm almost 100% sure she did. So I can just slide this off and keep everything together. Here's her pocket letter. Oh my goodness. Look at that. And look how she crochets at the bottom of her pocket letter. Oh, I need to get that. This is where I, you know, I know. Okay, I had to get the phone, so I think I was opening up the pocket letter to show you the pocket letter that Velma had, had made me. So this it is. And like I was saying, she crochets at the bottom. Isn't this? I think this is such a neat idea. Yeah, I actually tried to do this, and I was like, because I can't crochet, so, so it, it didn't work at all. It was a joke. So... Isn't that so pretty? And the paper, isn't that beautiful paper? And I like that paper. And she has little trims. It's got those 
you know, crystals inside. And here's that little clock again with some more. This this is the trim that she sent me to, some of that. With some little flowers and a button. Yeah. And she's got some more little sequins going through here. Some flat back pearls. And she put a little bow on that one. And then there's a little butterfly here with the rose. And down the side, she has this. I think this is it popped in. This is have to pop that out of there. Not that she put that in there on purpose to hold it. Okay. And then she crochets this. Isn't that pretty? The leaves. And then there's the side. Oh my goodness. Oh. And some flowers and some appliques back here and some flat back pearls and trim. Oh, there's a little butterfly there. And here's some silk roses and a, and a rose applique here. Oh, and she's crocheted around this big button. Isn't that neat? And here's a little applique here and she has her little letter inside here. I'll read that later and here she also crocheted around this film but this is gorgeous and here's another one I think she has some tea in here I see tea and some lace and these in here she has some little um, words printed out on paper little sayings another wooden button and some butterfly applique what a beautiful pocket ladder. Okay. Well, Velma, this is gorgeous. And um, I want to thank you very much for doing the uh, pocket letter swap with me. Um, and um, I'm going to leave uh, Velma's link, like I said, down at the bottom for you to go to her YouTube channel, which is... Uh, channel it's teacup and roses and um, check her out she's amazing she does amazing work so I want to thank you again Thelma and I want to thank all of you for watching and I'll talk to you again soon bye